Hello guys and welcome to another miniature adventures review. I am so so sorry that uh, it's been a while, I haven't been too well, plus the holidays and everything, it's just been very very crazy. So we're diving back into Hero Quest. This is the Hasbro Pulse um, kind of Kickstarter crowdfunded one. So we did the base game which will is now in retail actually. Um, and we're going to move on to the expansions. Now these are almost exact replicas of the original expansions. Um, and they are, uh, they, the only thing they really changed was maybe some artwork and the miniatures. Otherwise the entire quests are the same. So if you do own a re uh, Keller's Keep from the original Hero Quest, it should work in this version. So let's take a look. I really like the way that they've kind of done these very nice neat boxes. Again, I like the artwork with the new updated dwarf. And then on the back, you can kind of see. Now I'm going to try and see if we can zoom in a little bit. Sorry about the glare. So we've got a couple new doors. And then we obviously, these I believe are the same sculpts that we got in the original box. They're not the ones you get in the mythic contents, but they are in the original. So let's take a look and see. Sorry, camera shaking a lot. So, let's take a look. Alright, so we get the quest book. I'm not going to flick through it. I really hate it when people do that. Um, but I'm going to kind of just go a little bit. So, we've got the alchemist shop. Um, basically, we go through... Sorry, you probably hear my furnace kicking on. We do have some new tiles. Um, stone map. New iron entrance. A wooden exit door. Um, and then, basically... You know the new stuff now i'm just going to move this off camera in case so i don't flick to the next page yeah i thought so some well yeah so the message from mentor and i believe then at the back a way to use the new um the new stuff that's in here so what is in here let's take a look all right so straight off the bat new blocks i believe these are new in fact look why don't we do this because we have this here uh okay so Cliff Corridor, so I guess basically you can fall off there. Weapons Forge, um, Clouded, these are new spells. The map, and then these are short and long stairways to kind of simulate you going up and down. New trap doors, pits, and some other bits. All right, now like I say, the sculpts, I believe are basically the same. Here's a look at the new doorway. Again, the original uh, plastic, oh, well, that's kind of cool, it has an eye. I'm going to look forward to painting that. And uh, this, so I guess these simulate like ways of coming in and out of the dungeon. Uh, these definitely look like the original sculpts. Um, I'm probably just going to put all mine together. Um, so, even in case you're not, <laughs> in case you haven't got it yet, this is the um, expansion that mainly deals with the orcs and goblins. Um, let's see what else we got. So we got some new artifacts. Do we have new spells? So we got some new equipment we can purchase. Potions of battle, potions of dexterity, potions of restoration, venom antidote. Oh. And then some new artifacts. So we got fire ring, magical throne. I'm not going to go through them all, but I'll go through them slow enough that you can see. Again, we're still sticking to the same artwork. Of course they will. Uh, you could mix these up with your normal, um, yeah, your normal kind of game of Hero Quest. I do like the fact that if you got the Mythic tier, you'll be able to get this. Now, they did release, since I've done this video, they have actually done a video uh, called the uh, Questal Pack or something. They added, sorry, they added a um, kind of a new couple of new heroes. There was a GameStop exclusive. I unfortunately couldn't get it. Um, so definitely are looking at really kind of uh, pushing this game. Now this expansion you can get, I believe um, it's it's out already. Um, and if you have the app, you can use the app to basically uh, to play this solo. Um, but again, I mean, I'm not a hundred percent sure if um, if these are the originals. Now these are the ones from the base game, and yeah, so they're the same sculpts. Uh, yeah, they're basically the same sculpts, so that's a little disappointing. Um, 
I would have hoped to have got more sculpts, but I mean, on the whole, you know, it is uh, just an expansion that adds more. So, you know, I, I, I can't complain too much. Um, but yeah, I mean, that is it. There's not a whole lot to it. Um, basically, you're just going down, I believe, into like a dwarven kind of thing. Um, and, and yeah, I mean, it's completely compatible with the original. Plus, completely compatible with the um, with the mythic expansions. And I believe you do this one before Return of the Witch Lord. And basically, the king is trapped in uh, Keller's Keep, um, and you've basically got to find a puzzle to get there. Uh, looking at the backs, we're gonna get we get 17 miniatures, eight orcs, six goblins, three abominations. The card tiles, obviously, two dungeon doors, and then 14 game cards. Um, and like I say, this is the this is the actual retail design. Like, there's no difference to this. So I really do like this. Um, so yeah, that's all really. I mean, this, these are very small expansions. I feel and without us going into the quests too much, they are kind of um, very quick ones. Um, next time we are going to be doing Return of the Witch Lord quest pack which I'm really excited and then I do have the mythic ones to do I wanted to do different videos because they weren't too long and people got bored so that's it from us guys like I say uh, follow us on YouTube if you're not already followed uh, we do have the website which is in the comments uh, we do have patreon if you you know you feel you want to help us out especially in these times um, we are starting hopefully our D&D campaign soon so I'm looking forward to that um, and we've done a few renovations, so I'm hoping we can start doing some battle reports again like we did The Walking Dead. Um, so that's all to come. So guys, keep on rolling those dice, keep on questing, and we'll see you soon. And Happy New Year.